Hello students, hello Mr. Stofkin, I'm Luis Miguel and I'm going to talk about the war. War starts with Cain and Abel, and the beginning of the war was a battle of persons that defend themselves using only their intelligence and abilities in their body. The humans fight for what they want. War is something that is going to repeat the rest of the life. Sometimes the war is between countries, the most of the time because politics. The normal people always need war because it is the resource that people is obligated to use in some situation of oppression. Like in all this in life, the war has changed with the pass of time. We can see the technological that is used in the weapons before you have to kill many enemies with only a sword. Now you only pull the trigger and kill them. Nowadays, the war is still because the economy problems into the countries, but the difference is that we can compare these centuries wars with a fiction movie. The weapons are mortal, only a bomb can disappear our country. That is why the people start having conscience and create some organizations to control countries and their decision to have control of the war. People discuss about the benefits of this advantage of war, thinking in the economy and talking about the global union of all countries. First war is vital for the economy in some cases, for example, in war a lot of important companies will increase their production, so they will need more workers. War keep out the terrorists of our countries. If war did not exist, the terrorists will have so much power, and now one will st no one will stop them. The war will really help people. When politicians want to control everything and oppress them, in Venezuela the people decide to fight against the government. The war is not is not bad. It always brings different benefits for the people and the countries. We all know that in a war the economy have many changes. The economy. Cam Camil Casam Punta says that a lot of economies flourish during war, primarily because a big boost to the defense arms and healthcare industries. War always helps society, giving the way of not being oppressed. It's known that people used to fight the regiments that have bad intentions with them. Finally, the war has long-term benefits to it now that war improves technology and technology then then could help civilians in other aspects of life. In conclusion, War have many good things. Some of them help the economy, technology, progress, but the most of the time helps the people. The society is not ready to end the war.